Yo, what's up? Uh, Kant! <laughs> Fuck, kind of forgot my name for a second. Uh, anyway, continuing Amnesia, The Dark Descent. Great intro already, I know, alright? Um, this is just the continuation. I literally just cut off that last video. And, yeah, let's just get back into it. I mean, we pretty much just started seeing monsters and shit. Oh, it's pretty... It's, it's scary. The water shit. The water, the water part at the very end of the last episode had me going. I hope that's not in the game anymore. If it is, then I'm, I'm screwed because that it was terrifying. I couldn't see it. I think that's the most terrifying part. I couldn't see it, but um, right now I just picked up something about someone having my journal. I don't know, but uh, I guess we're about to find out together. Anyway, let's get into it. I get my headphones. Shit just falls out three times in a row. Here we go. There's lights. Second of and there's July, nice music. 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, Ooh. I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Poor Herbert. Maybe if he wasn't such a dick, Karma wouldn't have caught up to him. Just kidding. <laughs> Don't be stealing mummy shit, yo. Fucking door's locked. My mustache is really tickling my face. It's annoying. It's getting really annoying. Oh my goodness. Levers? No, nothing. Someone's already looted this house. Where's the M16? <laughs> yeah, this house has been loot looted. Except for this. They must someone was looking for something, I guess. 3rd of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages, trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, mm -hmm. Herbert dryly states, We covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion. But suddenly, I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, mm -hmm. an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He Forget finally the visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. Ooh. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Not the orb, because Herbert don't want you to have it. He said it was broken. Oh, it's no good anymore. You better just leave it. You better just leave it alone. Did I go to bed? What? Still having nightmares, I see. What's going on? Yes. I can't shake them. They come every night. We'll put a stop to them. You'll see. Just put this pillow over your face, Daniel. It smells quite good. Mmm. Yes. Yes. Smell it! <laughs> Can I get this open now? I got a crowbar. Give me the... Oh, no. Yeah, I do have a crowbar. No joke. Yeah, get the fuck. Oh, bust it wide up. I just broke the crowbar. The key. Please, let it be here. 
crowbar is a piece of shit. Fourth of July, 1839. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. How the nice. The pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them. But somehow, I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. Mm -hmm. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. It's all too strange. I don't understand. It's beyond comprehension. Hello. You know me. There is something here. Get the fuck out. I just had to deal with something. I thought this was a nice place. So I need the fire. When I go into a room, find places to hide quickly. I leave. It's supposed to be like a. I thought there was supposed to be like a key in here or something. They all come out like that? Yeah, what was the point of this? I feel like I'm missing something in here. Damn right, son. Oh, I'm. Who knew? I knew. I fucking knew. I knew it was fucking somewhere in this piece of shit house, piece of shit room. Fucking falling apart, almost killing me. Get the fuck out of this. Room. 
He panted heavily. Trying his best to keep himself from screaming, the medicine cabinet had never been overturned and lay collapsed on the floor. He reached through the broken glass door and grabbed all the sedatives he could find. He's probably never do that ever again. I'm gonna edit that out. Back to the game. Was the door locked? That door might have been locked. That was only the guest room. Right? Whoa, what the actual- I didn't even see that! Hey, buddy. Squishies. Oh, that's nice. The strange letter frightened him, but it was also the only one which offered him some comfort. Woo! I like the music and stuff and the whole atmosphere. It's a really good atmosphere game. Some fucking noises, like, for real, so. Like, what is that? Dogs tripping. Good. Hmm. Poor doggy. Who's t who's hurting that dog? I could help them. I don't know how to get the fuck out of this house, though. All these fucking books around. What is this? Uh, how many pages is this? Jesus. It's a letter from Heinrich. Oh, I probably have to read it. To my most trusted student and friend, John Hanawire. The most remarkable thing happened to me as I was traveling through the Prussian woods this summer. I finally found one of the ores I've been looking for the past, the last twenty odd years. It has been inex inexplicable, as the Heliodromus described it in the Hortus Cocklusus. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, man? It was as. It was as. It was told about an underground mytheric, really back to this, mytheric temple crowned in the unearthly artifact. The orb was big enough to fill the cup's hands, and the texture was smooth and jagged. Its color washed while rich. Contrast is not enough to describe its nature. It was an impossibility, an artificial paradox captured within stone. I was staying in my nearby village called Aldast again. Again, investigating one of the antiquated trials when I finally found the cavern. I went inside and simply I could verify the truth of these enigmatic artifacts. They were real. Whoa. As you can understand, this is the most important discovery of my life, but it has also become my greatest fear. As I entered the underground chamber, I could feel that I was trespassing because of my curiosity. I did my best to fight these instincts and fetch the orb from its place. I scrambled out of the chamber into the woods. I could sense something was following me. It bayed loudly as it closed in. The beast, this guardian of the orb, was relentless in its pursuit. 
I made my way to the nearby ravine where I stumbled upon some fishing men. Some men fishing in the lake. I tried to warn them as I passed, but unfortunately they remained as I continued my escape. When I heard their cry of pain echo through the valley, I felt such a tremendous sense of relief, thinking I would be spared. Suddenly, a blue shimmering light engulfed me and the colors of the forest were washed away before my eyes. I kept running through the bleak surroundings the trees turned charcoal. Charcoal black with leaves of cinder, the ground covered in murky water. I pressed on through the drenched land and this, the glowing ember gave way to the rising wind and rained on me. I could hear pleading screams in the distance, and I joined in as pain and fear overtook me. I fell to the ground, gasping for air. This certainly must be... S ah. Man, this is intense. This certainly must sound strange, but I had been carried miles away across the Alps to a grassy field outside Genoa. The Guardian had taken the orb from me, but still, until this day, I fear its return. Sometimes I lay awake at night listening for the howling cry I heard in the forest. It has been nearly a decade since that day, and I still haven't been able to write about the incident. The last time we spoke, you told me about your interest in ongoing research into the mythic orbs, and I realized I owed you the truth about my visit to Alstad. Alstad, uh, your friend and mentor, Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa. That was long, but that was cool. A little story. Yeah. I needed to know what happened to Heinrich. Those dogs are just wild and, you know, wild and. Got to make myself occupied so I don't go crazy. I don't really die in the. Oh my god, what is going on in this room? Here, doggy. Animal experiment! At least this is short. Canis lupus familiaris. Ninth. That's a six. 1658. <laughs> April 12th. So early, early in the day. After a short study, it is clear that the agitation found among humans can be found in a, the dog. Fear and pain induce stress, which means to trigger an endogenous response, causing the animal to burst with energy. I believe that the catalyst is produced in the brain. Mm, it is difficult to determine exactly where and what it is, but I can sense it. It reeks of cosmic genesis. There is an inherent problem in harvesting this energy since the creature is bound to die from the exercise. I must refine this process of torture to enable any real work to be done. More experiments must be performed, but it seems that the only human beings are able to produce the amount necessary. It might be their ability, ability, ability to appreciate the severity of the process that ultimately augments their experience of terror. <laughs> yeah, so he was abducting people because he's a dick and abducting po doggies. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> look, at, look at this. Really, dude? Like, what did you do to this poor thing? You cut him apart and then sewed him back together. Nice. Guy's a real doctor. Could have probably looked it up in a. Book. Let's see what you have to offer. <clears throat> ah, what a mess! I should have sharpened the saw, but I can sense it. It's definitely there. Dude, you're a crazy man. This guy reminds me of Layers of Fear, dude. He's fucking crazy, and he's not. It's not acceptable, damn it. No. Oh, 
out the way, bros. Well, I guess you don't have a closet. You're a dick. Call that a penis? Mm. <clears throat> is there nothing in here? Just bones? What is this? Nothing. Cool. I guess that'll be here. Find a way around the rubble. Oh, good oaks. I'm gonna. Did you throw something in here? Thanks, bro, bro. Oh my goodness. Look, I'm gonna die. I'm not crazy, bro, bro. She keep doing that one. Go inside, please. Thank you. Goodness. Stressful. I might need that actually. Shit. When will it be my turn? Have I not shown restraints? My patience spans centuries from where I came. Mankind is not even wasting a breath. Yes, I bow to you. I have done so much for you, and I have gained nothing in return. Agrippa, I trusted you. It was I who, in all fairness, should have entered that gate. Ooh, someone jelly belly. Someone be jelling. Jelling, be jelling, be jelling, be jelling, be jelling. So I won't be tripping. Elevator machine. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to fix something. If the elevator breaks down again, make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling it into the machinery. Adjust the levers to gain to get the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. The meters should read up eight and down eight. Make sure the flow is set accordingly to the following chart. Trinity seam set functions. Four phase amplitude. Complete steam flow cycle. Note that the machine will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. Ah. That is a rod. Oxy doxy. Where 
is this thing? Do I have to go back? study or something like that okay so I need to be grabbing stuff all around this place I'm like trying to think of something to say, but I can't. This game has got me in the zone right now. Oh my goodness. So I have the key to the machine room now, so I'm sure there would have been a... Dude, I thought I told you. Bro, bro, you can't come in. Same exact spot, too. Music's not as pleasant anymore. I don't know if it's changed. But it doesn't sound as nice. It's over here. Hello? You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum at Regent's Park has one. Well. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer, and in the other direction. Oh, I know it's not gonna work. Yeah. Yay, the pleasant music. Skyrim music. Beep, beep, beep. Bitch, I got the key. Nah, the me. So, we are in the machine room. And what do we do now, boy boy? Gonna fuck shit up. It's nice and bright down here. I like it. You wouldn't think of that from the machine room. I'm not scared of you. Who was that? Was that my guy talking? Eight down eight. So what would the up eight be? I guess it doesn't matter. Let me try this. Ah, I get it. So they're different. Uh, hmm. What can I do with this one? That's. D 
do you have to use them all is another question. Alright, we'll come back to that because I don't even have all the July 1839. Today I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Mm. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. Oh, the, the most orbs. interesting aspect the was orbs. the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may in fact have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. Not in here, go away. What the actual fuck is this? Can I use this? Cool. That's one. Note that there are only two spare rods left in the storage of the elevator machine. Fuck! Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged and keep the others in the inner study. Okay, so I got I got this one. That's two. Two in a study. Fourteenth of July, eighteen thirty-nine. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Mm. Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Oh yeah. Gonna get you damn pills, get me the hookup, bruh. I ain't got no health insurance. Tinder, oh come on, just open for me. Open! Uh, don't be rude! Uh, I'm not crazy. I need to go to the study, I think. Seventeenth of July, eighteen thirty-nine. How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their Ooh. skin flayed as if boiled. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith, Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. Mm -hmm. I have no choice but to trust the Baron. He better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. Oh shit. 
Ah, oh, fuck. So I do need. Damn it. You know, those things did look really important. They were too big not to be important. Well, time to go back. I gotta get those jigger things and... There's a couple of them. Were they all in here? I don't know. I'm gonna find out. There's one. I wonder if I can just like shoot it on there. Pew pew pew! pew. doesn't fit on that one. It's the same thing, but I want it on the left. Makes sense, I guess. They're not confused. There we go. Last but not least. My nose is itching. I'm trying not to sneeze. More work! So I need all the rods, so I just need to go back to the study and grab those rods, shove them in those holes, big old rods in them holes, and then I can get that baby working, working just the way I like it. Mm, yeah, about that lip. Mm. Yeah. Back haul! Professor Taylor was the second death caused by his damn curiosity. This kind of sounds like a story of the mummy. You know what I'm saying? To the study. Break out through! Break out through! My dog is straight chilling right now on all my pillows. But you're fucking comfortable. Chairs. It's not even a chair, it's just like an ottoman. It sucks ass. I was tempted to buy the Foodie Pie chair. Just because it's cheap. It seems nice too. Very, very tempted. <sighs> it was cheap so much for a fucking chair. I could go on vacation for that kind of money. You know what I'm saying? It's always hard. Where am I? Am I in the same place? This isn't the same place, is it? What the fuck is this? I don't like this, wherever this is. Crazy. Oh, 
I didn't even see that. It doesn't light. Awesome. I just wanted to go to the study. Oh, it's the journal again. Find a way to start the engine that powers the elevator. Darkness in the storage room feels strange and unnatural. I am in the storage. Girl, the key is entering through the best storage. Find a way to get through. Yeah, it is unnatural darkness in here. It's very annoying. I don't like it. Don't like it one to bit. She's like right over there. And I heard someone outside. Freaking me out, man. I'm on the edge. I'm on edge, man. Oh, shit. I feel like I got like... What's that? Another trail part. I like it. I like all this stuff you're giving me in here. Hell yeah, boy. Well, what does that help with down there? What's all this trail shit that I am picking up? I don't know what it's for. Land in them. So much to do. This poor girl, where are you? You're not in there. You're not in there. You're not in here. What is the point of down here? I thought there were rods. One more door. Ugh, Alexander. I have prepared the explosives you needed for clearing the flood drain. I can't stress enough how important it is that the mixture can, is handled with care. Please try to tell your feather-brained servants this before you go ahead with your plans. The liquids are not by themselves explosive and can be, and should be kept separated to avoid further mishaps. I have arranged two large vats in the next room for the ingredients. All you need to do is mix the liquids and you are ready to go. Agrippa! Ciao, bello! Well, that's nice, so.
think I got everything. Trail. What do I do? What would I use it for? the lab I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that but I have it now yay well, that's two ingredients for creating an explosive mixture ah so that was one way check this way again. Oh no, nothing. Shit. So do I need to find another like a barrel thing to stab? Or No, 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 no. Uh, I know what I need to do. Instrumentos. There was a barrel down here, if I remember. Another barrel. That's nothing. It's not in there. Because that's nothing. Alright, so. It's not in here. We're going to have to find another one somewhere else. It's a matter of where.
Now it's getting to like the puzzle shit. I'm like, uh. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The shame will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. in here. Alright, so... I have half of explosives liquid on me. have the drill so let's look around I feel like I might have seen a barrel down here somewhere. could be very wrong Those fuel rods are. I mean, oh. yeah. So to get farther, I have to find the other half of the system. Let's So it's not down here. Yay! Let's go! I have to find this. It's not in the machine room. I didn't see another thing to take liquid from. So it's behind that one door, but it's like, how the fuck do I get that door open if I have? So it says it couldn't budge. So. I'm trying to think of where I've seen another barrel like that one. Yeah, 
study. It's not back. That way it would be fucking back. Fuck, man. I hate it. Like, this is exactly what I hate. Gosh, it's just in here. Why did I go back in here? I get stuck like this. But I'm looking in the storage. I didn't see anything. It was just that one. Guess they're not has shit. X, X that shit off. The study. Study had one of the rods. That was it. I guess it too. Is journal. Okay, we are clearing the flood drain. Okay. So it was, it's in there. It's in the fucking storage. Same fucking room. Oh. Oops. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Great. Can't believe I just did that. Bye, boom. Look. How do I set it off?
so am I supposed to just like wait? I don't get it, man. It's gonna blow up. What is going on, man? So is it gonna blow up or what? What's the dealio? Here, bro. How does it go off? How do I blow it up? <laughs> like, I don't get it. Oh shit! <laughs> no! Oh dear God! Just have to smack it around a little bit. Oh, that's so dumb. I need health. Like now. Fuck. Why are you doing this? Get away from me! Oh god. Oh shit. Oh shit. Can you not open doors? Moldy bread and giblets. Well, I'm not going in there. Jesus Christ, dude, that thing is pissed. Oh God, <laughs> what in the actual fuck is going on in this place? Oh, why it burns? Yeah, it burns. <laughs> Oops. What the fuck was that? Whatever. Let's just keep on the moving. <gasps> I found the rods. Yay! It was a full set of three rods. It is wait. 
If a full set of three rods is unavailable, there's one in the inner study rooms which might work. I already know about that because I have it already. So, Is he there? Where am I supposed to go? I gotta go back to the machine room. Oh, he's there. So I'm in such storage room. What the fuck am I supposed to do with that? How am I supposed to how am I supposed to get around that? to like run around them. Fuck out of here. Ah! No! Oh god! Just run, motherfucker, run! Run, run! Run, you bitch! Why do you run so fucking slow? Go! Oh god, no! There's nowhere to hide.
Oh, that fart grass scared the shit out of me. Oh, you way, man. No! Tell me it's here too. It's here. It's fucking here too. It is. It's gonna be here. Why? Because like, this game is starting to hate. That's blood. That's a blood centipede, baby. And there's a dead body in there now. Hey, buddy. Are you okay? That that does not. No, it's not good at all. It's like some Zerg shit. Oh man. It's gonna be stress, stress. Very, very stressful. It's a good game. I like it. It's on sale. But you got both of them for four bucks. Pretty good shit. Pretty good. Another good game. Another good game. This is really dark in here. It's really annoying. I don't like it. These fucking things, man. Just like alien. Yeah, they're here. It's bright down here. Why am I going crazy? Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so I need eight up. Yes! Uh! Puzzle Jake! On the move! Making progress! Feeling smooth! Oh yeah! Smooth as fuck, homie! You see that shit? Other than that last step, that was not very smooth. That was pretty bad, actually. I was right there! I was there! My guy was just like... Ugh. Ugh. I can't make it! My leg's broken! You bitch. Is this where I shoved the rods? Yes, it is. All the rods are in place. Things are looking good, bro, bro. Things are... I think that's it. I don't want to go down there. Oh, fuck. I have to pull the fucking lever. Damn it! And what goes in here anyway? Poop? You poop in there? What do I put in here? Farts? Needs more work. Uh. Well, what do I need?
is this? Fuck, man, I thought I had it. I don't know what the fuck is in there, though. I don't know, man. Oh, this is this sucks. Cause I thought I had it all. Oops. Oh, I guess Oh shit! Can I just put like a box in there? No, 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 no. Coal. Oh my goodness. Yes! Oh! I didn't know what this was. Here's some more. Let me get a few pieces. Kobe. I was getting really fucking frustrated, man. Kobe. Oh, uh, yeah, this is fun. It's a nice little, like... You like this one? Uh. Damn, boy. One more time. Last one, and then I'm just gonna be for real about it. Oh! Fuck yeah! Just enough. Let's burn this, baby! Your monsters, fuck your fuck your day, you blobs of meat, or whatever that is. Oh, I'm sorry. Jesus Christ! Just let me on the elevator. Come on, just let me out of here. This thing's killing me. Ow, fuck. Is this even the way out? Oh, fucking shit. I'm gonna die. From what? Blobs of poop? Oh, the meat shits? game is fucking ten. Oh! Nothing, nothing happened. Oh, and everything's turning into shit. Everything's turning to shit. Oh, 
But we knew that. We knew that since we started the game. Boom! Professor Taylor was the second death cause of blah 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 blah. Hey, wait, that was my floor. Okay, I guess we're not stopping. Oh, stop it! Stop. Oh, shit. No! No! Stop it! My guy is dead. Descended. Achievement. Unlocked. The fuck? What the fuck? Ugh. So what is this place? Okay. Well, I'm going to take a little, I'm going to take a, a, a food break. Um, shit. Ugh, I made it. Yes. Still progressing. I like it. I like it a lot. Thank you. All these puzzles, they're not like super difficult. They are manageable for me. So. Keep it like that for me, please. Anyway, um, I'm going to stop it right here. Thank y'all so much. Really appreciate y'all tuning in. Um, come here, Ruka. Come here, Bippus. Come here. Say bye-bye to everybody. Thank y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm putting up these two videos for now. I'm going to keep up with this. I'm going to play all the way through The Dark Descent. Um, it's a great game so far. I'm loving it. Uh, I also have the other one. So I'm hoping to do like a, a little duo kind of series going on. Um, and then continue with the rest of the horror games that I ended up purchasing. So anyway, love y'all so much. Come here, babies. Say bye-bye to everybody. Come here. There we go. Yes. She's so cute, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Anyway, say bye-bye. We love y'all. Thank you for tuning in. And we'll check y'all later. So, uh, I don't know why I did that. Don't, don't. Oh my god. I'm just gonna, yes. Bye. Thank you.